Hi, this is Bala Reva. Welcome to Bala Reva UAE Path YouTube channel. Today we are going to see how to delete the rows, delete columns, and finally how to do the copy as picture. Please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon never miss the update. Your subscription makes me to create more videos and components. First we need to install the package. Go to manage and packages, select connect and type Bala Reva EC. And select the Bala Reva EC Excel activities and install it. Check the version, it is 24.0.0. Before we go to the process, let us see the sample file. So source is the sample file. And here we have many rows. I'm going to delete 7 to 12 rows, 12th rows, 7 to 12th rows. Okay, I'm going to delete these rows means in the CDL number start from 6 to 11 okay we can see how to delete these rows so what I do copy file I'm going to select the source file and the sample data file so always I'm going to use the sample data first we need to use the excel scope activity and in this excel scope we have to select the file it's a sample data and after that i'm going to use the delete rows activity and here you have to specify the sheet name let us see what is the sheet name this is sales order sales orders Okay. and this is an array but you have to specify only one items okay I'm going to specify the range it's 7 colon 12 okay good I'm going to execute the process okay let us check the output See, we don't have the serial number 6 to 11. And if you want to delete only one row, you can able to use, for example, I'm going to delete the sixth row. And here you can able to specify only six. Okay. I'm going to execute the process because the sixth row serial number is five. See, we don't have the serial number 5. So if you want to delete single row, you can able to specify only that row index. And if you want to delete a continuous range of rows, you can able to specify starting row, colon and ending row. So this is the way you can able to delete the rows. Next, we are going to see how to delete the columns. In the activities panel, you can able to see the delete the columns so i am going to delete the d d column so here this is also a same it is a array but you have to specify only one element so i am going to delete the d so d colon and d okay you have to specify like this way to delete a single column so i'm going to delete d close and the sheet name is sales orders let me execute the process okay good let us check the output see we don't have the rep column so it's deleted and also I, so now I want to delete the E column to H column that means item to total okay so in that case you have to mention E to H 
E colon H. That's all. Let me execute the process. Okay. Let us check the output. See, we don't have column after the rep. That means item to total. Okay. This is the way you can able to delete multiple columns. Next, we are going to see copy as picture. We go to the sheets images here. You can able to see the copy as picture. Okay. Let me show you the sample file. So in the simple sheet, I'm going to only copy this range. That means a1 to i20 okay so here i'm going to specify cell range is a1 to i20 okay and the sheet name is simple okay if you want to save as an image here you have to specify the full path of the image so I'm going to save in the temp folder t colon slash temp slash images slash test.png. Okay, let us check we have the path is exist or not. D colon and temp images already we have one image we need to delete this one yeah images test.png okay so let me execute the process before that i'll close the file okay good let us check the output see see here you have an image okay and also the image is in clipboard okay let us test with the ms paint if you go here and press ctrl v see it's in the clipboard if you go to the word you can able to paste it see it's in the clipboard so this is the way you can able to copy as picture thank you for watching this video Please subscribe the channel and press the bell icon, never miss the update. Your subscription makes me to create more videos and components.